What's up guys? This is Marco Flores today. And in today's video, I'm going to tell you guys what the best boxing shoe in the market today is. Let's get right to it. So when you think of boxing shoes, you think of the two best, the two best boxing shoes that come to mind. Number one, the Mizunos. I want to give a shout out to my, my good friend Katsuma. Katsuma gave these gave me these shoes all the way from Japan. Shout out to Katsuma. He's pro right now. He's 4 and 0, I believe, right now. Katsuma. He gave me these Mizunos. I already had Mizunos before. Uh, the first time I tried Mizunos, I was about 18, 17. And I was like, damn, these are really the best shoes. <laughs> and uh They look cool. But they're so pricey. That was the only downside. And that they wore off. They wore out so quickly. These are a little worn out. And they suck because they slide. You can slip. Like when you're about to punch. And if it's super you worn out. You could, you could slip. Like your shoe would just go like this. Boom. But the material lasts a lot. It does last. They're like three hundred dollars, maybe more, three fifty. Um, they're really good. I like everything about them. Now, the, the Mizunos. I'm gonna place them in second. I do. I truly believe these are the second best shoe ever when I tried these shoes on and I tried this before these I tried these before the Mizunos and I had no problem I don't worry about anything I just put them on and it's, it's, it's go time it's go time the hyper KOs the first one I ever had was the uh, the red and white ones I don't know if you guys remember I, I did give those away to a friend the red and white ones uh, and uh, they first came out because I had my Maconis Maconis and like Maconis I had those the first time and those are really good Maconis are amazing amazing I'm gonna I'm gonna do a review on those soon but uh, I don't know if you guys remember the first hyper KOs that ever came out were the white and red ones the one for Pacquiao those were the first ones, but guys, these right here are around 210, 220. They don't have to be green. It has to it could be any color, and I truly believe these are the best shoes. Why? Resistance. These are super durable. Super durable. I like these shoes because you can be in the boxing gym and you could go outside and it's just gritty. It's just durable. And they'll still look nice. You could have them for three years, won't have to worry about them. Just put them on, boom, boom. It's it's, it's go time. It's, it's time to go to war. You could you could use them to every fight, and you don't gotta worry. You super dur even after the second year, they're still good, and they're like wine. Even when they get older, they still look good. They feel the comfort wise is amazing, just as good as the Mizuno, even maybe even better. Because they have, I don't know if you guys could see, but they do have a little bit more. It feels like, I feel like the Mizunos are, I feel like the Hyper Kills are better fit for your for your feet than the Mizunos are. Because they're a little bit smaller. And I do feel like the, the Hyper Kills are a little bit better. They feel better because they're a little bit bigger. But they're light, they're just, they weigh It's about the same. I couldn't really tell which one's heavier. You would think the Hyper K would be heavier, but it's... It might be the Hyper K by a little, but you won't feel it in the ring. And it's so durable, like, the Hyper K's, you, 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 could, you could move your feet on it, boom. You could... 
a lot of these guys who move their feet, they use the hyper KOs. A lot of the fast guys use the hyper KOs. These are for boxers, for inside fighters. These are the these are the shoes. They just they're durable. You can move your feet really good. Um, throw off combinations. You could plant your feet. Dude, that's another thing. You could plant your feet more with these shoes. When you're about to knock the guy out, and it's time to set your feet on the ground more and throw the power shots, fake some power shots, and then throw some power shots. Um, you could plant your feet more than the Mizunos actually. With the Mizunos, I feel like it's a little bit less. With the hyper kill, you could plan your feet more. And guys, for the price, these are going to last you much longer than the Mizunos. I do have the Mizunos the second best shoes out right now. And the hyper KOs are the best shoes, period. These are the best shoes. And you will not, you guys will thank me later. But search no further. Um, if you're looking for a boxing shoe, this is the number one shoe to get. There is no other boxing shoe that I recommend more than the Hyper KO. It is the best shoe in the market, period. If you look at any of the top fighters, they're using Hyper KOs. And that's that. They look fire. They're durable. You can move well, you can plan your feet well, you can box with these, you could inside game with these. They'll last you for your they'll last you for a good amount of time. They'll be a bang for your buck. You could do this to even make it more secure. What else could you want? These are really the best shoes. And I say it because I've used them. So that's that guys. I really recommend these shoes. And keep following my journey and if you guys want to purchase boxing for life beanies i have red or blue you guys just you just uh press the link below and you guys could purchase a boxing for life beanie they support me with my career and future endeavors so and they're limited edition i'm not making these anymore but i anyway I, make sure you guys subscribe and i appreciate you i appreciate you guys from the bottom of my heart these are the best shoes period for boxing Let's get it.